Hey everybody, welcome back to the Ticket Webcast. I'm Dave Paulson. Joining me again this week is Jen Todd. And the circus is in town. And Jen, that's not a figure of speech. The circus is literally yes. in town. Or coming to town. Or coming to town. <laughs> uh, so what's going on? So um, this is the Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey presents Built to Amaze. Wow. Quite a mouthful. But yeah, yeah it's, it's called Built to Amaze. So it's construction themed. So in the show, you're going to see the acts um, kind of tell the story of how to build a circus. And so the ringmaster and um, these two clowns, um, Alex and Arena from Russia, hmm. will be kind of the foreman of the show, and so they'll lead everyone through, and um, there's a song, and so you can see, um, you know, the clowns, and then there's going to be the animals, and there'll be the high wire art uh, acrobats, and then they have trampoline acrobats jumping through the air. They have a human cannonball who's actually a girl this time. Mm -hmm. And uh, so all kinds of fun stuff going on with that. And um, so that'll be at the Bridgestone Arena this weekend. And uh, there are tons of different opportunities to see it. Um, it'll be at 10.30 and 7. 10.30 a.m. and then 7 p.m. on Friday, oh, wow. 11 o'clock, 3 and 7 on Saturday, and 1 and 5 on, sa on Sunday. So plenty of opportunities to see it um, within the price range from everywhere from $15 to $156. Okay. So, um, you know, fits within <laughs> most people's budget yeah. there. Um, so yeah, be sure to check that out. Cool, and you wrote a, a piece for the ticket section on Friday, yes. and I heard you talked to a clown. I did. With the clown. I talked so. to one of the clowns, um, and it's interesting because uh, he was talking about how he gets to, they get to choose like what outfit and what makeup they get to wear. Oh, okay. And um, so he said that he, he likes to do a lot of um, PR things where he'll go to you know, the hospitals, or he'll go on a news station and, mm -hmm. and bring the news that the circus is coming. So he likes to dress as a newsboy. So oh. a clown, clown <laughs> version of a newsboy. So yeah. he has oversized, um, what are they called, wing clip or wing tip shoes yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and a little cap on and everything. So uh, be sure to find him. His name's Chris Sullivan. He's a really nice guy. He's from Tennessee, too. Gotcha. gotcha. If only we'd done some little later in the week, maybe he could have stopped by. And right. Clown, <laughs> a clown. Next time. Um, well, cool. And, and, and past times when the circus has come to town, they've had, uh, or maybe this is, this is what, uh, well, it's Barnum and Bailey's, too. But they've had parades. I guess this time they're not this doing time, it. It's really not, cold. They're so. not doing the animal parade. Um, there's, they said that there's just too much construction around, uh, and so for the safety of the animals, they decided to not do that this year. Yeah. Okay. 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 In, the, in the middle of polar vortex, I'm not sure yeah. Crazy the Plus, it's would freezing be. cold. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so we'll skip it this time. But they'll all be down there at, at, at Bridgetown, and then you can read about that on Friday. Also happening this weekend. Have you ever seen uh, Driving Miss Daisy? I have not. I've actually. not seen it either. Well, perfect. <laughs> well, let me tell you all about it. Uh, well, there's a play. There, there's the the Driving Miss Daisy play that's coming to Chaffin's uh, uh, Dinner Bar and a Theater um, happening this weekend. Uh, you can find out more about that at dinnertheater.com. Man, that's a good domain they got there. Uh, <laughs> of all the dinner theaters, congratulations, Chaffin's. You got that. That's happening this, this weekend. weekend. Kathleen Madigan, the comedian, is at uh, the Skirmerhorn on Friday. Uh, it starts at 8 p.m. Tickets are still available at nationalsymphony.org. Um, uh, Cindy Watts actually talked to her, and you can read their interview on um, Tennessee.com. I think a little bit of it will be in the ticket section on Friday as well. Uh, a jazz show coming through uh, Nashville, the Blair School of Music, at 27-year-old John Batiste. He uh, plays the piano and sings. He's from New Orleans. And he's hooked up with like three other 20-something just, you know, virtuosos, and they have like a fun, funky jazz New Orleans kind of band called Stay Human. So they're at Ingram Hall at the Blair School of Music on Sunday. And then finally, I'll be covering this live uh, next, next Tuesday. Tuesday, the Musicians Hall of Fame, which uh, sort of celebrates a lot of the behind the scenes players and session musicians behind big hits. There was that movie, uh, Standing in the Shadows of Motown, that talked a lot about like the Funk Brothers and these famous bands. So it's those kind of guys that they, they sort of honor. And uh, they had to move their location in Nashville a few years ago because the Music City Center was right. coming in. Uh, they finally found a spot at Municipal Auditorium three years later, opened up last year. And so this is the first time they've had this ceremony, an induction ceremony in like four years. They're inducting Barbara Mandrell, Peter Frampton, uh, Buddy Guy, and a bunch of others. And so some folks like Neil Young, 
uh, Billy Gibbons from ZD Top and the Oak Ridge Boys, and they just announced uh, Chris Isaac will be performing also. Oh, and that's happening Tuesday in this pool. I hear there's still tickets available for that, and you can also follow our coverage live, Tennessee.com slash music. And I have to mention, of course, that Nashville's Deacon, uh, Chip Eston, will be hosting that. Oh, that's okay. just the latest place where you can catch De Deacon on top of Nashville <laughs> from week to week. Well, well, awesome. So the circus, you have like 20 chances to see the circus yeah. this weekend. That's a bit of an exaggeration, but what, like this eight times. So, so uh, read Jen's story in Friday's ticket. Jen, thank you for joining me. And uh, we'll see you guys next week. Thanks.